what's going on guys this is Zach aka Zio Fox here and today I fired up the old 3d printer well at this point in time the time that you're seeing this it's been probably 24 hours plus after the print has been done you know what screw it I'll just throw the intro I've got the T800 skull loaded up in Cura, my slicer program of choice. Uh, you can go find this model on Thingiverse. Uh, link will be in the description below, pointing you in the right direction. The T800 skull that you're looking at right here, Barnacles Nerdgasm. You, link to his channel will be in the description. Uh, he actually was printing this at about the same time that I was. He finished a little bit farther ahead, that's just due to the issues that I was having with my printer, but, eh, oh well. It's, this was this complete, took me completely by surprise, I was not expecting to print the same thing as him at the same time. I, I mean, go figure, right? Now that it's loaded, we're just gonna hit File, Save G-Code, Save tells me that it's saved and we're gonna send this over to the printer should look good when it's done <laughs>
right guys it's done it's off the printer and it took roughly 28 hours 28 hours to print this thing so that means your your printer is going to be running for quite a bit of time and I was only using 10% infill and I was running it just about full speed all the way minus the uh, first couple layers just to make sure they seated to the build plate well but here it is here is your skull now I've already removed just a little bit so you can get an idea of what it's gonna look like once I get all the support material taken off alright guys check back with me in a little bit and I will go ahead and show you the absolutely finished product without all this nastiness on here alright be right back all right now that we're back it's been about 15-20 mm, minutes of just trimming off the uh, excess support material and sanding it off who knew that nail files would be the best way to clean off that little itty bitty burrs that are left on the side of the plastic hey if you haven't tried it go out and do it because it does work a hell of a lot better than a pair of pliers and now we have a finished product as you can see all the detail is there yeah you'll notice that there is some uh, black on here but that's only because the plastic that I ran through first was in fact black and another perfect print using the color fab material this time I was using the color fab XT alright guys thanks again for watching I really hope you enjoyed this video I had a blast making it be sure to hit that like be sure to hit that subscribe so that's it for this one I will see all of you on the other side of the interwebs take it easy